you have a certain amount of fat cells that by the time that you're a teenager, you have kind of a, a certain number. And if you gain in general up to about 10 to 15 pounds of extra fat, those fat cells just get bigger and then you lose it and they get smaller and you gain it back and they get bigger. So 10 to 15 pounds of even pure fat gain, which means something like 15 pounds, maybe to 20 pounds pushing it of total tissue gain during a massing phase, probably more like 15 pounds of total tissue gain during a massing phase, plus or minus 15 pounds does nothing to your fat cells except fill them up and then reduce them, fill them up and then reduce them. However, if you go much more than that on a single gain phase, at some point, your fat cells get so big that the nucleus inside of them, the control center of the cell, think of the analogy here as if the cell is a town, the nucleus is like the post office, the fire department, the police department, the hospital. At some point when the cell gets big enough, it can't control its own exterior and then it would start to malfunction. And evolution is a very, very well thought out way of how to deal with that because it's been dealing with eukaryotic cells for like billions of years. And just the same way as if a town gets big enough, you can't rely. Scott, can you imagine if Manhattan had the only fire department, hospital, and police station for all boroughs of New York City? 